Hi, this is just a really quick demo of a super simple time tracker which is designed to stay out of the way as much as possible and some ways of playing with that data. Um, I actually had this idea three years ago and I wrote up most of the code and also blogged about it. Um, but I recently revisited it thinking it would be neat if I could integrate some R graphs. So this is just the very beginning of that work. The idea is super simple. Um, we have a bunch of um, categories that you see here, um, one for each uh, number button, and you can set those categories any way you want. I differentiate between reading for my PhD, other work I do, a few paid projects I'm working on, and some other stuff I do. Um, so we can go and pull up the cheat sheet, and we'll see here that I'm right now I'm surfing uh, for the last seven minutes, and these are the hotkeys, which you see are exactly the same as the categories. And so if I want to switch to something else, let's say I want to do an errand, I can just press the right button, and you see here that it's switching, it says last thing you did was surfing, now you're doing errands. And the um, way it tracks time is it just writes the time code and the category to a text file, one text file per day. So here you see errands was just added to this text file. And then of course if I want to see what I've been doing all day, because oftentimes you wonder at the end of the day, where did all my time go? Um, I just press another button and it pulls up a nice graph, shows me I've been working for six hours and eight minutes in front of the computer and um, spend most of my time on errands, I spend some time learning and so on. And this nice graph is actually generated using R. So I first uh, export uh, just the number of hours I've used on each category to a CSV file that looks like this. And I pull it into R with this simple script. So I'll just load the library. I pull in the data and you can see the data here and then I uh, generate a uh, graph using ggplot and I write it to a PDF and we can see that PDF right here it looks like this and then as you see I just display it using Pashua. So right now that's a super simple graph which I could probably have made by using a Ruby library but once we get the data into R, it opens uh, a lot of possibilities. Once we have data for multiple days, you can do correlations, you can do time series, uh, you can do all kinds of fun stuff. So that's it for now. Uh, the code is on GitHub. It's pretty messy right now, but um, I'm hoping I'll, I'll have some time to keep working on this and uh, gather some more data and have some fun with it. Thanks.